Hey there YouTube, <clears throat> just a little uh, note for you here. I have a 2009 Ford Focus with the Sync audio system in it. And I had a problem the other day where it would display on the screen here the name of the song, all the information about the music from the USB flash drive down here, but it would not play any audio. So we'd have the display working, telling me what the file was, what it was supposed to be playing, and it even showed as it playing, volume adjusted, anything, I couldn't get anything to work. By the grace of the wonderful internet, I was able to find a solution though. So what I did is you have to reset a fuse. There's a fuse specifically for the sync uh, system. Now to make it fun, you have to get clear underneath the steering wheel here and there's a plastic panel, you just yank it off, just pops off here, I have that off to the side, my handy dandy flashlight here. And there's a fuse box in the most possible, possibly convenient location, right through this little crack. And if you're like me, and you have big hands, you can barely even fit your hand through there. But that's where most of the fuses are. Now, as it turns out, in here, see if I can try and show you, on the top right of the fuse bank there, it is the fourth fuse down. It is a five amp fuse. Let's see if I can get my hand in here without blocking your view here. Uh, Try to see what I'm doing here. Uh, okay, so uh, I can't even show you here. It's too dark right there. But there's one, two, three, and four fuses right there. Fourth fuse, there we go. One, two, three, and four. This fuse right here, this little five amp fuse, fourth one down from the top, that is your fuse uh, for the sink system. Uh, and what you gotta do is you gotta turn, uh, turn it on Make sure the key is in the ignition. In fact, I'll just do it here. The key in the ignition here. Sorry for the noise, I'll tell you right now. Come on now. There we go. You turn the system on just to, to accessories. So you have your display working. And mine's already fixed. Pause that. And then all you do is just, you pull out that fuse and it'll automatically switch to the uh, radio. And then you will put the fuse back in, and it will begin to work it once more. And that is a, the quick, easy fix. Uh, if you need another idea of where the fuses are, check in the manual. It does have a diagram in the roadside emergency portion. Originally, I was looking under the hood here at these fuses, thinking it was somewhere easy, and it is not. It has to be in that little tiny fuse box inside. So, just so you're, if you're struggling with the same issue I had, that's an easy fix for it. Hopefully this helps, and uh, see you next time.